Alex in the house. Uh, Y'all know me. Sitting here with uh, yet another fat Chipotle burrito bowl. Got the kettle Maltese. Uh, this is actually my first one since I put uh, Bad Hat on Blast about a month ago. Uh, I got nothing, nothing self-referential for this vid. Um, just gonna go to town on this shit. Uh, I do, however, have but one personal shout out to send. Uh, I think you all know who I'm talking about. Miss Thang, uh, Annie Clark, St. Vincent. Uh, St. Vincent, you've now blocked uh, four of my Twitter accounts, and I'm just here to let you know that I don't. I'm not to be shut down that easily. Uh, I'm not intimidated by your status. You're not better than me. Uh, for every account that you block, it, it just makes me stronger. Um, and really, for every, uh, account that you make the effort to block, that just makes it all the more gratifying and worthwhile, because you're taking time out of your busy schedule to block me. Little, nobody, lonesome, me, Ryan Dix. Uh, when I uh, apologized to you uh, about a week ago about that comment that I made um, about looking up your skirt when you crouch down at your shows to uh, twist the knobs on your guitar pedals, uh, well, I actually don't apologize for that. It's a, uh, it's beautiful and it's nothing to be ashamed of. Uh, I'm sexually attracted to you. Uh, the more videos I watch of you on YouTube in those tights, uh, the more I want to see you naked. I want to have sex with you. Uh, is that a crime? Uh, is that some kind of an impossible concept to grasp? Uh, what, you, you don't have sex? Fuck out of here. I don't believe you. Um, and I just believe that when you come here next February to, por to perform your show, uh, I believe that you should give me your hotel key or your hotel number 24 hours in advance and that way I can come and meet you and spend the night with you or if you're going straight to LA after the San Francisco show I want to come with um, I think this is just something that we need to do it feels right to me um, You're the, you're the, you're the, you're, I'm the one with the big muscles, and you're the one with the nice buns. Um, like, I mean, I look at this, and I just, I think to myself, like, look how, look how cute we look together. You see? How could you let the, all that go to waste? Uh, you know, I've been, I've been practicing kissing you, uh, to prepare for this show. Um, you know, you have the option here. You could either, I could give it to you, you know, uh, slow and passionately like this. Or, I could, you know, I could pull you in and just plant one on you like this. Uh, you know, the choice is yours. Or, or, 
<laughs> we could skip all that shit and just go straight to this. <clears throat> you know, you have the option. Fortunately for you, I'm a sex master. Uh, you've got nothing to worry about when you're with me. So that's pretty much all I got to say about that. Uh, so let's eat. Um, alright. And I want you, St. Vincent, to personally watch me eat. Mmm. Mmm, mmm. St. Vincent, do you like Chipotle? It's a burrito bowl. I'm actually going to take uh, the rest of this time to uh, watch last night's episode of uh, NBC's The Office. Uh, I had so much anxiety from St. Vincent last night that I couldn't bring myself to watch it up until now. So, uh, you know, you're, f you're free to tube out now at this point or stick around. Uh, I could say more shit. Uh, I could just sit here and eat and watch some shit. It, anything goes on this channel. So. Where'd it go? Oh, here we go. In, uh, in Sexy Pony, St. Vincent's Honor. Office. this to you in a relatable way. You are all members of the Yakuza, and you happen to be visiting the Lackawanna Trolley Museum, and you are attacked by triads. How can you hold them off until your clan arrives? You cannot go wrong with a throat punch. Okay, so there's no defense for that. Good to know. No, there is a defense for that. Let me demonstrate. Someone attack me. Kevin, go. No way. Last time you pulled my pants down, and then you tried to choke me with my shoelace. False. I did choke you with your shoelace. Now come at me! Okay, with all due respect to everyone here, I think the most worthy opponent of you is you. That is correct. Unless there happen to be measles present. So let's just say that Dwight has come at you with the throat punch. Now how would you, Dwight, defend against it? Easy, allow me to demonstrate. I am attacking myself with a throat punch. Here it comes. Block. Grasp wrist as such. And what if he comes at you with the other hand? Because he does have two. Good point. Second throat punch. Absorb the blow. Groin punch. Hip block. Elbow to the gut. Uh oh. Up to the nose. No, you're not. Ah. Oh. Oh my God. He's making you look like such a fool. He really is. 